Hi, I'm Dan and today we're going to be veneering this plinth from the last episode. So that's going to be bonding this veneer, burr walnut, to this plinth. So these are the things we're going to need for the veneering. We've got a roller tray, roller, we've got some pre-mixed PVA that you can get from any hardware store, uh, pre-mixed with some brown pigment. We've got the burr walnut veneer, the plinth, two sheets of MDF, roughly the same size as the plinth, you'll see when we clamp it up and 4G clamps. Okay, so, so what we're gonna do now is roll out some of this PVA glue, just to get a nice even coat, just forward facing strokes, just enough to cover. You don't want to pull it back like so, because you run the risk of snapping the veneer, and then you've gotta go back to the first tutorial. So if you want, a, if you want to, glue both the plinth and the veneer we're only doing the face so we don't need to go around the corners don't matter if you go back and forth on the ply because obviously that's a bit thicker than veneer okay so now we flip this over Okay, so now we've offered the veneer up to the plinth. You just want to go around the corners, making sure it's covering. Now, I did forget to say earlier, but we are going to need some masking tape. Don't matter, one inch, two inch. I prefer the two inch because it grabs onto the wood a bit better. So you just want to level it out on top. Remembering this is only just to tack it on. It doesn't need to glue anything down. Flipping it over. Making sure we're all level again. Taping it on. Now we're going to sandwich it in between these two pieces of MDF. Like so, making sure it's nice and central. So now, the reason we've got these two pieces of MDF is so the G-clamps don't crush the plinth make the veneer look unsightly or damage the back. So you're just want, gonna want to put one on each side, not too tight to begin with. You're just wanting to tack it on and then tighten it up later. Final clamp. And then you're going to want to go back to the original clamp, tighten it up. All the way. Okay, so now we've got the veneer on the plinth, sandwiched in between the MDF boards with the G clamps, squeezing it down nice and tight. So you're going to want to leave this overnight to cure. And that's it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and join us back tomorrow.